Ah, the joys of parenthood. It's great when your baby's finally sleeping, playing, and feeding their self. They learn how to walk and say a few words. It's honestly a relief from restless nights, numerous feeds, and just the general stress of trying to keep an infant alive. Life's great. <laughs> oh my gosh, here we go again. You excited? Mm -mm. How many months, weeks, how far along are you? 39. Today. Before we go in, we gotta tell y'all what we're doing. Well, I'm gonna tell you, cause she's not a morning person. I found that out this morning. I actually haven't done that, so. <laughs> I was just talking and talking and she's like, this is where we're different. I'm not a morning person. But it's all, it's like, 525 and I've been up for an hour and 25 minutes just about every day Look at her. she's just like can you hurry up all right so she's 39 weeks pregnant today is the day that we have Luca baby number two coming today are you ready for a baby another baby yes yes I know I'm ready to meet this guy but uh I don't know what's going to happen, bro. I don't know how we're going to do it. <laughs> how do people do it? I don't know. Honestly, I don't even know how we did one kid. I, it's, it's a miracle to me how we survived that and how we raised a kid so far. Parenthood, man. It's, it's not an easy. No easy task, that's for sure. It's not for the faint of heart, but you're not ready, but you are ready, and you know you just somehow figure out what it takes and and do it. So, yeah, we're finna go in. And have uh, baby number two. It's gonna be a process, but hopefully sooner than later. Made it in. She's all hooked up some machinery. She's a robot. And now we just wait. Hopefully, less waiting than waiting. All right, so it's 1, 12 p.m. Got here at 5.30. Here we are. We got a patient here. How you doing? Yeah. She's doing, she's here. She's epiduralized. Water has been broke. He has been turned. She's strapped up and wrapped up. She's using 15 blankets. Got the peanut ball. She's got a lot going on. That's your update. <laughs> she said thanks. All right, guys. So, different shirt, different room. So you know what that means. Different day. Different day. Yeah, two <laughs> days later. We got a baby. And I don't know what to say. It's a boy. Yep, yeah, it's a boy. There he is. And uh, I've already changed the diaper. First diaper, it was very quick. Done like 12. We've changed like 12 or 15 diapers already. Definitely didn't go the way we were expecting. More on that later. But uh, yeah, just wanted to let y'all know we did have the baby. And. There's the back of his head. There's the back of his head. So here we are. Let's see if we can get him in there. There's mom. Hey. And baby. Baby doesn't look. He basically just sleeps. And we have to force him to eat. And then he'll wake up again and eat more. He doesn't want me to talk about him. But yeah. He's here. He's healthy. Mama's healthy. That's that. We're finna, hopefully, about to go home. And I'll probably update y'all more about everything there. But, uh, just wanted to get a good, get a quick look at the baby for y'all. At the hospital. 
I know it's been, it's y'all don't know it, but it's been like two days since the last video. Uh, we were literally waiting and waiting, and then all of a sudden it happened. Here we are, two days later. How you feeling? Better. Better. And, uh, he's feeling pretty good, if I say so myself. Probably. It's probably gonna hear. Yeah, probably not that good, actually. He liked being in there a lot better. Less work. So, see y'all at the house. Alright, guys. We made it home. Six weeks later. <laughs> Here's Rylan. What you think about the new brother? He ain't new to you anymore, is he? There he is. He's he's probably grown since you saw him last. Six weeks. That's how long it took us to get home. Not really. We've been home the whole time. <laughs> I was going to say we put it off for six weeks, but I don't think we really put it off. We just, just didn't put it on. Yeah, I think that's where we left off. As I said, yeah. see y'all at the house. <laughs> we'll tell you more. But yeah, here we are. And uh, how you feeling? Six week old. Birth story, basically, go to the hospital. He was turned sideways, so they wanted to move him. Gave her epidural. She hated it. She said she'll never do that again. Not without being in labor. Uh, she didn't want to be induced, but she ended up... Did they induce you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they basically induced her because... Basically, they did. Yeah, they they induced her. Because that's we just wanted to get him out. Yeah, get, go ahead and get it over with. Be a little safer uh, than waiting in him being backwards. Breach... <laughs> Sideways, whatever he is. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Told you I wanted to snack. Brown's a mess. He goes through the garbage, the sink, <laughs> he plays in the water, he gets everything wet. Whew, he's a mess. Hours go by, whatever. Nurse comes in, checking the dilation. <laughs> he just poured it out. She, whatever they do to check dilation, with the centimeters, whatever they is cervical it? check. Cervical check. I'm talking. I don't know what I'm talking about. They do the cervical check. Cerv cervical check, and the nurse feels the umbilical cord. Long story short, emergency C-section. I didn't know what the heck was going on. What was going to happen? How long it take? Anyways, three minutes later, it felt like it felt like forever, but it was really only like you know three minutes in the operating room, and we had baby. Here we are. But yeah, we got Luca here. He is probably about eight pounds now. Slow start. Both of them had a slow start. Rattling was real small for a while. But due to all this right here, this eating, he got bigger. And he's getting bigger. And uh, hopefully we're getting to where we can start sleeping a little more. What? Actually slept five or six hours last night. Here he is. Luca. L-U-K-A. And Rylan. He brought another box of the same cereal. What a guy. But yeah. We waited six months. Wait. <laughs> six weeks to film this extra five, last five minutes of this video. So, y'all gotta like this. I mean, I don't know. You don't have to. Free country. Free world. I guess. I don't know. And more cereal. So yeah, we're officially a family of four. You never know these personalities and these little babies. And our not so not so little baby now. We got home from the hospital and Riley came home and we were just like, bro. Five times bigger. Did you just grow overnight? He looks so much bigger now after having this little bitty baby. He's probably the same size. But he's very sweet. He just gave him a kiss. He tries his best to be sweet, but he does do... Well, he doesn't do it as much, but he used to hit him a lot. He does a lot of poking and grabbing and pinching. But a lot of loving, so he's trying to be a good brother. He's a little rough, but he didn't know any better, so gotta give him a little mercy. And, yeah, we're trying to give each other mercy, because lack of sleep is not a good combination. Abby's the best mom ever. So that's a wrap on the video. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed watching our little... If, if there's anything Dada! worth watching because I didn't put as much into this video as I did the last one. But I just wanted to, really just wanted to document it along the way. What? I'm going to have to shoot a video for Ryland just because he loves being on the video. 
So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, we're here six weeks later. It is what it is. Stuff happens. And, I mean, the big thing is that this is finally recorded. And who knows, it might be six more weeks before I ever put this video out. I told Abby I might just film a bunch of videos and drop them all at the first of the year because they're so busy right now. Tell Luca bye. He's waving. Say bye. Oh, <laughs> he is pooting yeah! goodbye. Say bye-bye. Bye. That's it. <laughs>